These days, it's hard to imagine life without the internet because it's become such a part of our daily lives. Yeah, ask any teenager. Right. Yeah. <laughs> well, that internet usage has a price. Our personal data is out there and being collected. Mm. Consumer investigator Steve Sprasia digs deeper into how you can stop it from being accessed. Steve. Angela Rod, a lot of us feel there's a lack of control over our personal data, and we worry about how it's being used and who is using it. As one of the big tech companies out there that collects our data, Google is offering a way to remove your personal data from its search results to help protect your privacy. But be warned, it's not an absolute thing. 86% of us have tried to remove or decrease our digital footprint online, according to a survey by the website DataProt. How worried are you about all that information that's collected by Big Tech? I'm extremely worried. I think we're in danger. In what way? Our, our information being leaked. And when that info gets on the dark web, it's sold. Security experts have found... Social security numbers go for just a dollar a piece. Driver's license info can be obtained on the dark web for 20 bucks a pop. And if your medical history is stolen, that information can be sold for more than $1,000 to any hacker who wants it. If there was a way to remove a lot of your personal data from searches, would you go for it? Um, depends on how tedious that would be, <laughs> time consuming. Google's now offering a five step process that begins with this request, allowing you to remove a lot of sensitive information from searches on its platforms. I basically don't use Google products because they're famous for taking your data. I use uh, browsers like DuckDuckGo, I use Mozilla Firefox. Google says when you submit the request, it'll evaluate it to see if you qualify for data removal from its searches. Among items it will remove, social security numbers, bank accounts, credit card numbers, handwritten signatures, ID documents, highly restricted things like medical records, personal contact like phone numbers and email addresses, and confidential login credentials. But not everybody thinks that search engine data removal will do any good. I used to work in IT, so nothing's really... Yeah, you know, nothing's anonymous. Like we, they have all our information. They can get whatever they want, pretty much all the time, anyways. And remember, even if Google approves your request to remove your personal data from its searches, there are still other search engines out there, like Bing, Yahoo, Ask.com, and Excite, and they can still access that information. So guard it carefully. Working for you, I'm consumer investigator Steve Spray.